What's up, Cowboy Nation? It's your boy, Cowboys Fan 0406. Coming at you with another fucking video. All right, so free agency hit, right? So let's talk about a key, some key things that are going on within the NFC East division. Brandon Marshall, two-year deal, six mil a year for um, to the Giants. Does that help the team? Uh, I don't know. We'll see. I know the Giants fans are ecstatic, but you know what? You have other needs. Offensive line. Um, your secondary is great. Um, uh, maybe another pass rusher. Well, are you signing JPP? I'm not sure. But your offensive line and your quarterback is a place where you need help. Let's get that straight. Um, now, that's the only big thing that's going on for agency. Another, another big thing that's probably going to happen is Tony Romo to Denver. All right, we're already going to release him. I think it's either Thursday or Friday. Can't remember. But Cowboy Nation, help me out here. Does that still create, when we release him, does that give us $5 million extra dollars in salary cap since we released him? And if so, if it does, then that means we have $10 million in uh, cap space, which will help us land a couple of decent, you know, role players that we need to hold us off, you know, till the following year to where we get more cap space. Um, but if it does create that $5 million, that'd be awesome. I'm not quite sure because, of course, you know, we still owe Tony Romo, whether he we trade him, release him, whatever. We owe him $19 million. $19 million. So anyway, Tony Romo is more than likely going to go to Denver. Now, Romo is the most hated quarterback in the NFL. Why? Because now I wouldn't say hated. I would just say most talked about. Most, you know, he's given the most shit in the NFL. You know what I mean? Because every time he fucks up, oh my God, you know, the internet breaks. You know, when he does good, no one says shit or it's like, it's like, oh, it was someone else that made the play for Romo to make him look good. No. What, what makes me sad is that Romo has kept this fucking team relevant for the past 10 fucking years. And people that are Cowboy fans that hate Romo, y'all are fucking retarded. Because what else would you want? I mean, I understand you want the Super Bowl, the playoff wins, and blah, 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 and that. But if it wasn't for Romo, we wouldn't be relevant in the NFL. I mean, would you want Quincy Carter still as your quarterback? Do you want Chad Hutchins? Do you want uh, Bradshaw? Do you want Drew Bledsoe? What do you want? Who do you want as quarterback? Because let me tell you, when Tony Romo took over, I was fucking excited. Because that meant every year we had at least a chance to uh, contend for a playoff. Not the Super Bowl, but at least get to the playoffs. Which I was happy about. I wanted us to get to the playoffs because you know what? It's baby steps. You don't just go, uh, you don't just, you know, 95 was the last Super Bowl and then we fell off a little bit towards the end of the 90s and then in the 2000s we just disappeared until 06. Because 06 is when Romo took over. And then when Romo took over and we started making plays and going to the playoffs and shit, then we became relevant again. What's funny is that when when Romo is not Romo is not leaving, and when he succeeds somewhere else, all these fucking uh, haters that hate on Romo are going to be like, damn, you know, he's a great quarterback, blah, 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 this and that. And let's get one thing straight. I love Dak Prescott. I'm happy we have him. He's our quarterback for the future. I see great things with him. But what pisses me off is that Romo never got his credit. And I don't give a shit what Cowboy fans think, thinks that I'm fucking delusional or whatever it is. But Romo, excuse me, Romo never got his credit. And that just makes me sad because he was such a great, he was a vital piece to this fucking, this franchise. It's, it, it, it's unbelievable how smart that kid, that, that, that man is. It's just unbelievable. But you know what? He's more than likely going to go to Denver, and I wish him all the best. You know, hats off to Romo. You know, I wish him the best of luck anywhere. And if he wins the Super Bowl, I'm going to laugh at everyone's face that hated on Romo, that thought Romo was not a Super Bowl quarterback or winning quarterback because, because he was a choke artist. Fucking idiots. It's, it, it, it's not Ro all Romo's fault. But anyway, that's another video for another time. But Cowboy Nation, I'm out. Peace.